hello traders it's Samurai Trader here welcome to this session how to day trade any market the purpose of this video is to give you an overview of a number of trades I've taken on the YM also known as the Dow now to be trading for Dow typically or the YM uh, you'd need around two to four thousand dollars per contract but please remember that you can start on the micro so I'm going to also show you that as well so I'm going to be showing you how I had three winning trades out of three in about 15 minutes now you may ask um, $500 a day how realistic is that if you learn the setups it's extremely realistic and I know for a lot of you $500 a day is not a lot of money well that's where you just simply add more contracts increase your position size now if in today's video uh, besides the fact that this is um, uh, unedited okay <laughs> there's no script I'm running to uh, you can apply the same setups to uh, all types of future con contracts Forex and stocks of course so as we get underway there is a risk in trading you can uh, pause the recording to read the disclaimer don't trade with money that you can't afford to lose stay on the simulator that is master the setups master your trading on the simulator before you go across to trading a real account now as I mentioned I'm going to show you how to start on the micros with the micros particularly on the YM you only need two hundred and fifty dollars to get started so it's a great spot to start and as I say to every potential client or every client that I have start on a micro earn your stripes even if you got that five ten fifty hundred thousand dollars then you can jump up to the large contracts now what we're looking for is markets that have 50 to 100,000 contracts traded daily so the YM this is fairly typical around 150 to 200,000 contracts a day uh, like on the ES which most of you have heard of 1.8 million uh, etc so there's lots of markets you can be trading have got plenty of volume so I mentioned here that uh, this was 15 minutes of scalping just before um, my live trading room so I run a live trading room as well as live coaching sessions for my members each week so on the uh, the Dom we're up uh, 655 but after commissions it's uh, 593 80 so very quick advertisement if you haven't already requested my ebook the truth about day trading please see the link below so you'll be able to download my ebook uh, as well please make sure you uh, give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so therefore you'll be able to be kept up to date with my latest videos even better still become a member all of the indicators you're about to see all of the strategies that I explain uh, you can obtain in the day traders fast track program make no mistake traders this will probably be the most comprehensive program you ever see for $197 now I have also a bonus running at the moment oh one thing I did I say this that all of my indicators are free so I don't charge for uh, indicators if you've got a trading program that I don't have indicators for I do give you the indicator settings so you can set up your own indicators it's it's straightforward now I have a special running at the moment where also I include eight live two-hour coaching sessions so uh, every Tuesday and Wednesday 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time I run a two-hour class teaching traders my setups how to day trade live uh, I'm going through the psychology of trading step by step how to read from the right hand side of the charting so that's included uh, one month free all for 197 which includes my program if you decide to continue after your, uh, your first month it's $97 a month so uh, you can cancel that at any time by the way we you don't sign up for that when you first join at the end of one, uh, your first month we'll send you an invitation to sign up for that so um, a very high percentage of my members will join that's the end let's get into this so first of all you can day trade 
basically 23 to 24 hours a day and the reason I say 24 hours a day you may be a Forex trader or may be interested in trading Forex unlike stocks where the exchanges close you can trade and also on stocks in the US you got the pattern trading rule so you need to have $25,000 so with futures and with Forex as well you can basically get going with under $500 so as we look at the charts today and I go through uh, how I trade um, the big thing that comes up which is the best chart time to trade well whichever is tradable okay so I'm, we're going to be looking at Renko charts I love Renko and tick but Renko are great for new traders or those that have been struggling because they really smooth out price action as you're about to see so during the Globex session that is after hours you could trade the one to two tick during the New York session particularly on the YM which we're looking at today you definitely need to jump up to the four tick if you're trading tick charts themselves 21 tick 89 144 and of course you can show uh, trade time-based charts volume etc now one of the golden rules and this is why you'll see I talk about having a two and a half thousand dollar trading account for the big contract we never risk any more than two percent of our account unfortunately there's so much rubbish out there we traders or we're educators or articles or educators so you can risk five percent traders that's a great way to not only go broke quickly to blow your trading account but even worse is blow your um, uh, trading confidence it's so much more difficult to rebuild a trader in their confidence when they've blown their account two or three times and so it's very very important traders that you never trade under capitalized if you don't have a couple of thousand dollars available for this particular market there are lots of others like the micro NQ like the micro Dow where you can get going for 10% of the amount and I'll show you the effects of that in a moment so here um, I'm trading five contracts now with five contracts it means then you'd need to have twelve and a half thousand capital now with that though let's look at this 500 a day two and a half thousand a week that's a hundred and twenty thousand dollars a year only going for a hundred dollars per contract show me any other, any other investment that will give me that sort of return so very important here and this is where traders lack the education in a lot of areas and that is brokers will tell you well hang on what's Ray told you you don't need two and a half thousand you only need 500 well what they're not taking in account is the risk parameters okay so if you hold overnight positions uh, so if you're a swing trader here are the current with one particular broker an excellent broker we use um, here you'd need to have eight and a half thousand or eight thousand eight hundred in your account but you can trade during the day uh, with only five hundred dollars in natural fact you can basically trade um, uh, nearly 24 hours a day or actually 22 and a half hours a day as long as you close any open positions by 345 central standard time in the afternoon look I'm getting a bit beyond it here but on the micros you can see there they say you only need um, uh, 50 well traders realistically you need two and a half thousand and you need two hundred and fifty dollars to do it my way the right way so what does this bottom line mean if you start off with two and a half thousand and you're targeting one hundred dollars a day net within 19 weeks you've got the potential of earning ten thousand a week your account is also now sixty one thousand dollars that's four scalps and you'll be seeing that on the charts in a moment or three eight tick scalps or, or, or day trades now if we look at this and by the way you can actually download this spreadsheet uh, if you click on the link below um, my staff will send it to you along with a, uh, a little video on how you actually use this but if we drill down a little bit further how it actually works is and I know many of you have seen this um, so maybe grab a quick coffee I'll 
this will only take me two minutes to explain here uh, if you're earning $100 uh, a day that's 500 a week once you double your money you can then start trading two contracts once you're now up to seven and a half thousand you can start trading three once you're up to ten thousand you can start trading four this is extremely conservative in my approach because we're using the markets money the whole idea here is that you're building both confidence and competence traders even if you've got 10 20 30 hundred thousand dollars as I mentioned earlier start small earn your stripes maybe after 10 20 weeks you might say um, uh, okay now I've got the confidence I'll add my 30 to 40 50 thousand um, uh, to that so if you go for 150 a day okay and if you can put two to three hours a day in and I'll show you in a moment what that would mean but with 150 you're at your 10 grand a week if that was your target within uh, 12 weeks and your account size there is now $50,000 okay so here earning 150 a day we can see there within 12 weeks now I know most people can't really live on there it's 12,000 a week I know you can't really live on it but you can pay a few bills now getting back to being serious here what if you've only got one or two thousand or what if you've only got five hundred dollars start on the micro and even if you do have a larger account start on the micro and here we're only going for ten dollars a day now we start with 250 and as you're about to see on the following spreadsheet in 15 weeks our account is now at 2870 that's where then we switch over to the big contract okay so starting with $250 $10 a day if we go to this one it's easy to see within 15 weeks trading part-time building your experience and your competence $10 a day you've now got 2800 in your account you can now trade or, or jump over and start trading the big contract going for $100 a day still being conservative and within 19 weeks is your 10 grand um, uh, a week traders get rich slowly you know you can yes you can make a great deal of money but you've got to approach it correctly and my job as your trading coach is to work with you to get you there not on false promises and these get rich quick schemes this is building using the markets money now the bottom line is it's going to take you 34 weeks to get there you've started off with $250 and look where you are then time's going to pass anyway and you know what I actually get members get cranky with me I'll get upset with me because I keep coming back to this but this is a reality you know when you've got a burning desire when it is when you've got a big enough goal you can do almost anything and that's this is what this means so we're about to get to the charts 15 minutes in to this so here's what's really important and fortunately Actually, every one of these now we have indicators that will plot these automatically on your charts where are our pivot levels the open high low and close levels major EMAs particularly on your anchor charts and I use an anchor chart one and I'll refer to an anchor chart two. simple concept but kicks butt intraday swing highs and lows the current days high and low and round numbers which we won't get into so with this one I'm going to show you how I got three trades three wins you'll see it on the screen here um, and I'll explain some other setups as well so let's pull this up let's see here over here and so we'll look the trades are a little bit further along but let's just start here because there's some really valuable information so this is what we call a two tick Renko now I call these steps because they look like steps with a two tick Renko it means that each one of these bricks and Renko actually means bricks so each one of these bricks is worth $10 but each little uh, step you see is worth $5 so to net $100 a day you need 20 ticks or 20 of those steps that's all you need in fact I'll say to traders forget the money 
focus on the process focus on the ticks the steps so up here uh, we're going to have a lot of members um, will also be watching this uh, we have a bet the farm on the anchor chart one up here in fact we were in a period of consolidation traders this is what we call the ice cream sandwich one of our members um, she has two of her children trade with her and they came up with the concept they we could now call the ice cream sandwich and that is where you've got two major EMAs are sideways in fact just here this is the danger zone okay very easy to recognize but then it turns into a bet the farm which I'm not gonna give away the secret of what a bet the farm is but very obvious and it kicks butt anyway down we come thank you very much then we have a t3 see this uh, cyan line here this is actually the low of day remember before I said it on that previous slide that you really want to know where the low and high of days it's like with pivots pivots open high low and close in fact if I crunch a slide up here there's a pivot uh, we go up here see that white line that's the prior days close uh, crunch it down a bit more that cyan line that's a prior days high the market will go up there and kiss these levels day in day out but we then had a t3 now a t3 yes I had a little bit of divergence but I'd say it's a very rules-based strategy and it does very very well but one thing I want to teach you here traders is what we call angulation very important with the trading that is where you see price action angling strongly away like this it becomes a mean reversion trade so uh, no I wasn't on that one you'll see the three in a moment but we had a t3 we then had a 2b and and by the way for members watching this uh, after you have a, a t3 quite often a 2b will, will behave very much like a 2bd just just remember that but then we had this setup notice here now we're setting in higher lows and see the white paint bar that's called our super scalper now what I've accidentally discovered is that and and even with my own trading trading a reverse or when the markets reversing can be quite challenging all right and I found something by using the anchor chart I call it the AC 14 or even the AC 13 which helps me identify increases the probability that I'm going to have a reversal in the market and that's if we're on these trades that's what we would have been trading each one of these and they all would have been winners but let's now look at what happens here so now we're trending up we're getting close to the trades that I was going to or did take I should say as you'll see in a moment we then had a little retracement now see how now we've made a new higher high just there and I've now got a new higher low and it met the conditions of the AC 14 but I didn't take that so we're coming up and I'm now getting ready by the way so 4 a.m. Uh, Central Standard on this particular week I was running the trading room and we're coming up and so it's an hour before I kick off and I want to fire off some trades with a target of $500 a day right I just want to show members how to do how to average 500 a day quite I don't yeah quite simply now I, I, I'm always hesitant in saying it's easy if it's that easy why doesn't everyone do it it's because the easy things are also easy not to do this these are all patterns traders they really are anyway we get up here I've now got a t3 again not only do I have a t3 on the entry chart but I've got it on the anchor chart one I've also got a t19 and a t19 means divergence on my entry chart so I take this trade now because I I also had uh, a t3 on the anchor chart one I went for a larger target so I went for 12 ticks so uh, for members watching this as you know when I have divergence 
on the anchor chart one I target the 89 EMA so this trade I treated exactly the same so I had a great t3 on the anchor chart one and I had it on the entry chart EC stands for entry chart for those that are not familiar with my abbreviations and down we come thank you very much okay so from there we came down a few more ticks okay a fair bit and now I jump back in on another with trend trade the reason I took this was the anchor chart one had then totally reversed so very important traders is not only whoops it's not on that one actually it's too hard for me to pull up but um, what I've got there is I have an anchor chart and I've got a special formula that I use on what size anchor chart and so what it's done it's flipped and from here on in it's telling me take every short trade for now so I didn't get on this particular trade but I jumped in right here and this is um, what we call a 513 B okay so I jumped in on this trade and I was after my eight ticks thank you very much now let me also say for those that are not familiar with my trading I'm a scalper I'd love to get in and get out it lowers the stress look I'd love to pick up runners look I know I could focus more on it but scalping works for me to me it's it, I don't have as much stress doing that all right where I could easily pick up you know quite regularly 10 12 ticks now by the way 10 ticks is $50 now remember what 150 meant where you were in 12 weeks okay so it can make that just that extra $50 per contract can make a massive difference so that was a nice winner then I had a with trend trade okay and that was a nice winner and then I got down and had a t3 that I missed okay, and and I had divergence so here I would have had a really nice t3 okay up we come and uh, I missed it I, and I can't remember why at the time but um, I was doing something so uh, we then I then missed that one and now I would have actually easily finished for the day then um, uh, that would have been like 10 minutes of trading and it's all wrapped up however that wasn't to be I missed it but then straight after that I had a 2b set up and I got in this late okay so I got in one or two ticks actually no I got slippage that's what it was it was slippage and that's one thing with the YM traders you get a lot of slippage on the YM now what that means is you want to get in a certain price you get in one or two ticks later particularly if you use market orders or even um, limit orders that are set as market orders that you can put an order in front now just to give you a little um, tip here traders whenever we enter a trade what I'm looking at doing is where's my last swing you can see I've got a swing low over here so there's really a couple of things that um, I, where's my entry where's my stop loss go and where's my target now typically my target is 8 to 10 ticks which is 40 to 50 dollars per contract that works well for me okay where's my stop loss go I like to put my stop loss one tick above and usually that's going to be a maximum of 10 ticks which is $50 that's why I say in with this particular market you need two and a half thousand dollars what's two percent of two and a half it's fifty dollars now quite often um, it's only your stop loss is only going to be forty dollars okay it doesn't always have to be fifty and in fact I prefer it not to be fifty so that's my my um, uh, stop loss that's where I entered and I look down here okay and when I see a swing low like that I'm always hoping I get through and down we come and we then got through it we hit it and I got my eight ticks so there I picked up eight ticks basically right at that swing low and you can see we only punch through by one or two ticks remember on the PowerPoint over here traders I said here you want to know um, where your intraday swing highs and lows are you want to know where the current days high and low 
so you may remember on this slide here let's go back or well not on the slide but live on the charts back here uh, I could show you there that was a day's low there are indicators that will indicate that for you uh, we want to know where our swings are okay and that's they're very easy to identify why because we bounce off those all the time now we actually ended up getting a reversal just there but with those three tree, um, three trees three trades let me get this out that was in 15 minutes so gross it was um, 655 net of commissions 593 now straight after and by the way we had a beautiful trade here that I miss and we had some well I didn't miss those because I wasn't trading uh, at that time so just here uh, we had a, a 2d there um, a 2d is a very mechanical reversal trade but now we then hit the uh, of a, the AC1 for trading conditions again and up here we had a, another uh, t3 and we had just up here it didn't qualify till up here by the way and we then had a t12 now what a t12 is for those that are not members is where we're bouncing off a major EMA on a higher time frame in fact we were bouncing off the 200 EMA on our anchor chart too why are they important well quite often you'll enter a trade here and if you don't use anchor charts or understand how to use them all of a sudden what looks like a great with trend trades you get rejected and what happened there but it was quite often we found resistance on a higher time frame traders mastering the art of day trading it's not rocket science what it is it's about pattern recognition it's about really understanding the patterns that we see and the patterns repeat themselves each and every day so $100 a day on this market $500 a day two and a half thousand a week it's realistic now one of just want to say one thing here how much time do you really need to be successful as a day trader well even if you hit your target here within 15 minutes like I have here you do need to be allowing and I've got to declare this you do need to allow at least two hours a day why you just don't jump straight on the screen and start trading okay you want to check your, your charts out you what we call your marked up charts and what I mean by that is this um, for an example for members um, I provide them with dozens of different charts and you go through the charts uh, just checking out the patterns and reminding yourself what you're looking for whoops and it's coming up on another screen I won't pull it down there but every day you spend 15 minutes 30 minutes every day going through your patterns because that's what this is it's a pattern and Mark Douglas in his excellent book um, of a disciplined day trader talks about if you want to truly master the art of day trading don't look for a setup that's mechanical look for one that's a pattern based and look look at this here higher high followed by a higher low a trade higher high followed by a higher low it's a trade you know it's about just simply learning the trades but then getting the screen time and then mastering the psychology behind trading unfortunately so many traders they're not willing to spend the time also mastering the mind you've got to give yourself that regular checkup from the neck up because this truly is a game of you're really trading against yourself in many ways anyway I've gone 30 minutes now so we'll wrap up here so um, uh, traders I look forward to seeing you oops oh I nearly forgot this and let's not forget traders for 197 you get all of my indicators you get uh, my entire program there's dozens of videos there you don't have to watch them all by the way there's all the indicators are free plus you can get eight live two hour sessions of oh, our recorded if you can't attend or for 197 dollars the link to join is down below traders i love day trading and i look forward to seeing you in one of my trading classes thanks traders